glad to see uh, my hot rod buddy who's uh, got the 23 Dodge Roadster and who's building the long nosed uh, 27 Studebaker rat rod and he gave me this cool piece this is the oven door off a of great majestic a wood cook stove um, actually the old rusty wood cook stove out on my patio that I've converted to propane uh, hard plumbed into my 300 gallon tank so I don't have to mess with those little swapping out little tanks uh, that that old stove is converted into a barbecue and it is a great majestic on the front of it it shows a ship and it says the great majestic and so uh, anyway kind of a cool piece it's a beautiful beautiful uh, creamy yellow porcelain I don't know what I'm gonna do with it yet but it'll make something cool Hi, Sparky. Did you hear me talking? You think I'm talking to you? Well, I'm not. Uh, I got another project going. I need a little table in the house to put my, my old uh, 1940s vintage wind-up Victrola wind-up record player. And by the way, my friend brought some really cool records up. Uh, and gave them to me. I'm uh, pretty excited about that. I'm going to be playing some of those. Uh, I got Jerry Lee Lewis, Great Balls of Fire, and uh, and uh, some other <laughs> classics, would you say? Anyway, uh, yeah, I'm building a table, so I'm using these old washboards. Uh, it's my table, and I'm going to get on with that. I'll check back with you. Thanks. See ya. By the way, uh, somebody asked me about it, but uh, about me doing all these projects and all my energy and whatnot, but. You know, sleep's really overrated. Uh, the only thing I do between midnight and six in the morning is just sleep. I mean, really, not doing much. So, I got time. I got time for projects. Well, there's the little table that I've been needing to build, wanting to build for my, what I call my iPod, my wind-up uh, Victrola, that old 40s vintage wind-up record player. I decided to use a washboard uh, on each side for the legs, and I purposely turned them um, inside out, I guess, or backside to the the outside and the smooth side in because I wanted that wood, that strip in the middle, and I put it out of the shelf down the bottom to put the records in. And I know you're supposed to store 33 and a thirds good vinyl on their side, but I don't think on those old 78s they're all scratched up. I'm not going to be playing them anyway. They've been stacked up, some of them for. 60 years already, so it's not going to hurt them if I stack them down there, but I just kind of wanted a place to put them. So I just got that put together. I uh, decided to uh, poster the top in that same um, burlap material that I did as a backdrop for that collage, those pieces made from that old hardware off of that old trunk. And I kind of like that, and that's going to match up in the house real well. And then I painted that shelf in the bottom the same color. It doesn't look like it now, but it's exactly the same color as I used on these washboards. And then I take some sandpaper and knock it down. So I'm going to let that dry overnight, and then I'll do that. Then that will match up. Then I'll take it in the house. I'll put my record player on it. I'll wind it up, and I'll play you all the record. All right, see you. Bye.